Hello and welcome to another Raggy's Beers, Wines and Spirits review. Tonight, I'm going to be passing the duchy. What shall I say? So, <laughs> Waitrose duchy, the duchy to the, uh, no, it's not going to that uh, Organic Golden Ale, uh, Goldings and Sovereign. Um, a refreshing light-bodied ale brewed with British wheat and organic hops. 4.2%. Doesn't say who's brewed it for them. Hmm. No. Doesn't say. So, on the website. Uh, launched as Dutchy Originals, then Dutchy Originals from Retros, and now it's Retros and Dutchy Originals. That don't mean much, does it? So... Let's uh, give this a twirl. So, golden to amber in colour. Um, white head that's just, you know there definite lacing oh right, I'm trying to find some interesting reviews for it so first review is actually quite a bad review to be fair a slight hazy golden colour with big white fast fading head. Yeah, it has faded. Grain biscuit and some floral notes. I got some biscuit and I definitely got some floral. And uh, mm. light dry bitter finish with some fruity taste. Drinkable, but just that. Um, another one. First sip, taste of bicarbonate and glycerol. Probably not what the brewer master intended. Rubbery aroma, some crisp biscuit malt, toffee popcorn and jam notes, redeem it a notch. Cherry blossom at a push, pretty dismal after a couple of quality German lagers. Mm. So, another one, 3.1 out of 5. Uh, appearance golden with a decent lacy head. Nose flowers and custard biscuits. Mm. Taste lemon and biscuit. I definitely get biscuit in the taste, but I don't get lemon. Palette light bodied with a creamy texture, dry but a finish, overall solid. Uh, pours clear golden amber with a thin white head, aromas of light floral hops, light spice, caramel. Taste is light sweet biscuit and more floral hops, clean finish. Now, from what I've read on it, um, the um, the hops have changed so the taste isn't exactly the same as what it used to be but they're still counting it as the same beer I'm definitely getting like a, a, a bready um, texture when I drink it um, yeah Oh, so it's one of them beers that, uh, you know, I've given it until I'm halfway down, start feeling any, any opinions about it, and I mean, I've just drank an half decent beer, uh, and this one, it's, this is more of a, it's one of them beers that's going to take you about an hour to drink. I can't waste an hour on a review. But, 
you get what I mean. It's one of those beers that's it weighs heavy on the stomach, and this is definitely weighing heavy. Definitely, definitely birdy tastes. There's a bit of fruitiness in there. There's a bit of caramel. But it's masked by that. Oh, you know, it's not the nicest of, of, of flavours. And uh, I've got to say, it's, uh, it's not a beer that would be high on my list to get again. That's for sure. I mean, someone else has put here, clear golden coloured, small white head, whiff of caramel in the nose. Sweet, malty, caramel, light fruity, and touch of unpleasant stale herbal hops with short, bitterish finish. Organic my backside. Oh. It's not easy drinking that in it really in um That was two unpleasant beers. I've done three this is the third review today. Uh I reviewed an Erding Alcohol Free, which was rancid. Uh I've done the Fullers and Friends Rebirth, which was quite nice. Not top ten or top twenty nice, or even top fifty, but it was nice enough, you know. And this, this is another rancid bit. Um, yeah. Yeah, you know. Obviously, all beers, you know, as beer drinkers, we want to try everything. You know, kids in the sweet shop try everything. But my God, maybe it's just me. Maybe I got an off bottle. So... Anybody who watches this who's drank it, please comment. And if you've got it or you're going to drink it, please comment and let me know what you think of it. As for me, I won't be buying it again. Oh, oh God. Do you know, if every beer was like that, I would pack up doing beer reviews because it's bloody horrible. Right. So, out of five... Very low, 2.5 out of 5. I'm not messing about with beers like this. You know, you know, you, I'm not going to, I'm not, I don't do it to make friends. Uh, I do it for honest reviews. And uh, if something's nasty, it's going to get, I'm going to tell you it's nasty. And that I didn't like at all. Am I wrong? Judging by what the, 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 the rate beer, uh, the aggregate um, scores are, probably not. And, uh, Really bloated me up, I know that. But yeah, didn't really rate it at all. Sorry to say. Anyway, thanks for watching. And please, if you have drank it or you're going to drink it, let me know afterwards. Love to hear feedback. Thanks for watching. See you soon.